super narrow. Better not drop my camera. Hey guys, I'm at JFK now. Behind me is Terminal 8 and I checked in already. It was an easy process. I'm taking Cathay Pacific to Vancouver. I wanted to take Delta, but you know, there's connecting flights, so I'm not gonna do that. But I like Cathay Pacific. Hopefully there's um, Wi-Fi on flight, but I doubt it, right? Mm. We'll see. All right, let's go check into customs and then I'm gonna eat. I rarely come to this terminal. This is Terminal 8. I usually go to Terminal 4 for Delta, domestic flights but it's pretty nice it's very quiet now all right let's go I'm wearing these today my Chanel's because they're comfortable Having a quick dinner at Bobby Van's Grill. There's not much here, but this looked legit. So I'm gonna try this out. I'm also testing a new camera, the Osmo Pocket, so I might be a little weird on this until I get a hang of it. Food is here. I got chicken parm with linguine marinara sauce. Got some mashed potato, mac and cheese, and what is this, ribeye? with green beans. Yep, bon appetit. Just got off my flight. It wasn't too bad. Too bad there's no Wi-Fi, but it is what it is. Welcome to Vancouver. Now I gotta go through customs and get my luggage. The airport looks really nice. Like I said, I haven't been back here for like eight years, I think. So I don't remember anything at all, actually. Pretty nice. This is at the airport. Jellyfish. Really cool looking. All right, so I'm in my rental car. Just a quick tip. There's no Uber or Lyft or any car ride sharing here, so it's best to rent a car or you can take public transportation. It's pretty, they said the train is pretty good, but um, I'm gonna try to do a few things, so I'm not gonna take public transportation. Um, all right, so here we go. Checking into Vancouver Marriott Pinnacle. It's like near the venue for SneakerCon, so that's why I'm staying here. Close by. Small room, but you know, it's okay. Let's check it out. Where's the light? Oh, I really hate hotel lights. It's like so dim and all that stuff. All right, there you go. Okay. Nothing to see. It's a regular Marriott hotel. I'm not really fancy, so maybe in the morning you'll see a better look. Okay. There you go. City view, not much view. All right. Call it a night. Good night. Good morning, guys. My official first day in Vancouver. I'm headed to get lunch at Earl's. Um, I saw good reviews on Yelp and also on Open Tables, so giving it a try. I didn't really ask for a lot of recommendations. Um, I also don't have a lot of friends in Vancouver. I think I have like only one friend actually. The weather is not that bad. It's not that cold, so I'm pretty happy about it. At least there's no snow, right? So gonna see how it goes. If this restaurant is good, hopefully it's good. We'll see. I'll share with you guys once I get a taste of it. All right, Earl's. There's a few locations. I'm at the Hornby location. Looks pretty cute. Let's see how this is. Earl's. All right, let's see. It was packed already, so looks pretty legit. Check out the menu. Pretty cute here. 
Look at this. Nashville hot chicken sandwich. Damn. I want some garlic fries. Oh, it's open kitchen here. It's pretty nice. Alright, so the apps came. Rhino fries. I guess this is their version of poutine here in Vancouver and salt and pepper wings. Oh my god, you know I love wings. Dry rub. Yes. Appetizers. I'm gonna eat. I just wanna make note that the wings are really small. It's like my size. I'm not used to looking at this because I guess the US wings all have hormones. This is super tiny, but it's really good. And my other food came. I got the peppercorn steak sirloin. Yum, smells really good. And over here is the Nashville fried chicken. Looks bomb with garlic fries. Look at this. Can't wait to eat. All right, so I'm gonna try the peppercorn steak. Let's see. Yum, it's really good. Cooked to my liking. It's good. I recommend this place, it's good. Alright, just parked, walking over to Capilano Suspension Bridge Park. It's a whole mouthful. Let's see how much this is. Dang, adult is $46.95, that's crazy. All right, so your girl just got to the Capilano Suspension Bridge Park in back of me. Let's see if you can see, it's kind of hard because it tracks my face, but yep, I'm gonna go in now. Excited. Pretty pricey, it's like $46.95 per person for adult for Canadian dollars, but still, you know. All right, we'll see what it is. I have two hours to spend here. I think that's enough. Ready to get on the bridge? I think if you're afraid of heights, I don't think you can go on. Let's go. Thank you. But the view is pretty nice. Yeah. All right, walking the bridge is super shaky. I'm wearing these today. It's wobbly. <laughs> I don't know if you can see how wobbly it is. It's a shorter bridge than I expected, you know? I thought it was like a lot longer. Whoa, it's mad shaky right here. <laughs> so shaky. Okay, let's see. Whoa, see how wobbly? I'm not even moving. All right, continuation. Almost there. Oh. This is Nature's Edge Wall Walk. Lego. This closes at 4 p.m. So they said come here first. Look what I see. Treetop Adventures. Mostly. Look at this. Hello. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm good. I'm visiting from New York. New York City. Yes. Welcome to beautiful Bay Columbia. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Bye. All right, treetop adventure. Look, it's up here. Pretty cool, and then there's a bridge over. Where is it? Yeah, right there. I'm gonna get up there. High elevation. Yeah. 
feel the breathing getting heavier. Treetop adventure. Looks pretty cool. A lot of steps, out of shape for sure. Waiting to get on. Last stop, cliff walk. <sighs> Tired. Workout. Do not block others behind you. Whoa. I don't know where it's. Look for this picture sign to take pictures. Cliff walk. Super narrow. I'll watch my steps. Better not drop my camera. Wow, pretty nice. You can see the bridge over there. Still learning how to control this, so don't mind me. Look at these icicles. Dangerous. It's still not at the top. Just finished a cliff walk. Really tired. Did a lot of steps and stuff. But it was kind of cool. This was smaller than I expected, so I thought it would be a lot bigger. I think I only spent like one hour here. But that's more than enough, I think. So I'm like breathing heavy, it's like really high up too. So I guess the altitude, um, the air is a little thinner. Now I gotta find something else to do. <sighs> Catching my breaths. Oh boy, I think I'm ready to leave. Oh. Arrival to Chinatown. It should be a big one because the Asian community turn left is on huge. Taylor Street. Then turn left on Shanghai Alley. Shanghai Alley. I don't know what to expect. I didn't know what to do, so I'm just exploring a little. Chinatown. You gotta visit, right? Every place I go, I try to visit Chinatown. If there is one. Here we go, Chinatown. How come we don't have one of these like signs in Chinatown in New York? I don't think I've seen that. We don't have that. It's so weird. I'm gonna go walk around. Just came into a Chinese supermarket and there's a lot of Chinese New Year snacks. Chinese New Year. Lots of snacks. I love this. This one, I'm gonna get one. What is this? Rice strip cookie with sesame. This is bomb. It's really good. There's a lot of stuff. Yo, this special kind of lays here. This is durian, which I do not eat. Salted egg yolk. Um, wasabi and kimchi flavor. Legit. Just got to the steam clock. First time seeing a steam clock. Pretty nice. The Gas Town Steam Clock. Considering 
to go up there, but not really sure. We'll see. So pretty. All right, dinner time. Gonna go to Miku, Japanese restaurant. Usually I don't like to go Japanese restaurants outside of New York because I love Nobu, but um, checking this place out because it had high reviews and it's popping in here. Looks cute. All right, gonna try Miku. Just got seated, really cute restaurant. Can't wait to eat, I'm so hungry. All right, let's see what's there to eat. This is sake pairing, I don't drink. So, let's see. All right, got some miso soup to start. Wow, lots of mushrooms. Smells good. Food time, got some ebi prawns. Yum. Food is here. Oh my goodness, it looks so good. Smells so good too. Yummers. Good morning guys. Here's a view from my room, but not much of a view. Just a city view. It's snowing outside. Not sure if you can see the flurries, but a light snow. I think till 6 p.m. today. Hopefully I can get some touristy things in today. We shall see. So cold. It's like still snowing a little bit, tiny bit. It's super wet out today. I'm headed to Cactus Club Cafe for lunch. It's like right near the venue and also right near my hotel. Like a four minute walk. So, and a few people recommended this spot. And the menu looked pretty good. So that's where I'm gonna have lunch and then see where I go from there. It's kind of cold. Can you see me blowing out? I'm not sure you can see. But yeah, I see Cactus Club Cafe already. We're here, Cactus Club Cafe. I had passed by here like a million times. No one here yet. But it's cute. All right, just sat down, got me a drink, Diet Coke. And then let's see what's there to eat. There's a lot, there's a big menu similar to the menu yesterday at Earl's but um, a little bit more looks good though all right I'm gonna order yep I kind of got what I got yesterday cuz just because I love it truffle fries today and again salt and pepper wings I think it's like a popular thing here oh my god it was so good yesterday I had to have it again yes bon appetit food is here got the prawn spaghettini and also got the blackened Creole chicken. It smells really good. Ready to eat. Check out this view. Looks pretty damn amazing. Not sure if you can see, but the eye, it looks better in real. I guess those are the planes that you can book to fly over Canada, but I don't think I have time for that. Gotta take a couple meetings and call it a day. Yo, know, so the food was real good, yo. Don't mind me. I look like a little turtle right now. It's really cold. The food was really good. The blackened Creole chicken that I got, damn. That was so good. I'm gonna be craving for that for a while. But I definitely recommend going to um, the Cactus Club, so. To my friends that recommended to me, good job. All right, drove through Stanley Park and now I'm at the totem poles. Gonna check this out. Lucky I asked my friend because if not, I think I would have got out the car and just kind of like browsed around, which is not that bright it's kind of cold see in back of me is the totem poles I don't know if you can see yep right here I'm gonna get closer to check it out yep right here all right in back of me see all right let's get closer all right here we are 
I gotta be careful not to step on poop. I think a couple people did. Like wiping their shoes now. Oh, cool. And of course I powered off by accident. Here we go again, let's try again. The floor is like super nasty. I'm sorry, my like focusing is not that good right now. I'm still testing out this Osmo Pocket. So bear with me, I'll do better next time. I promise. drive a little bit and then now arrived at the Brockton Point Lighthouse right here the background is amazing look at the mountains they're like a painting in the background really nice landscape there we go nice day the snow stopped and the sun came out, but it's still really chilly. I'm back in here. If I go further, you can see it. Now, next stop, I'm trying to think, I don't know where. I check the uh, Google and see. Nice scenery. Stopping by Herschel to visit my friends. Who's that? <laughs> Hi. All right, Herschel, the corporate. Looks cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, you just went out for a break. Oh, no, it's not. Look at this the actual Herschel Josh Beatas luggage and backpack. Hand painted? Yeah, oh, wow. Yeah. Look at this. This is dope. This is going home with me, just kidding. <laughs> Kiki Lala, who's Kiki? Kiki is on the left, Lala is on the right. So cute, hi. They're like, mom didn't say I get to move, right? <laughs> okay, okay. No, the camera's still on. All right, Aberdeen Mall now, and then I'm headed to Spirit Tea. My girl, Trisha said that this is like the best tea spot. They're gonna open one in LA and New York soon, I think. I'm excited. Spirit Tea. There you go. Looks really cute. I hope I'm going to the right spot. Yep. Let's see. So cute. Let's see what there is. Look at the pastry. It's like hearts for Valentine's Day. Little macaroons. Oh, look how pretty. That's cute. Let me see. What else? Oh, fondue machine. Hi. I'm just waiting for my friends first. Look how cute. Valentine's Day? Perfume, oolong, and we're getting very, very. And strawberry cloud tea. You want hot or cold? I want cold. Uh, strawberry is cold. Yeah. Alright, so they're making. Which one are you making now? Oh, uh, the perfume. Perfume? Yeah. So we can like un undo it and you can No, see no, it's fine. Are you guys from like Taiwan or? This store, yeah. Oh, Vancouver yeah. first one? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Here's my three teas. This is uh, strawberry, very berry, and I think perfume wulong. Excited to try. The cups are really cool. They're opening in New York in March. Look what we got. They brought out some goodies. This is in the this, this is on the secret menu. What is this? 
Bird's nest something. I forgot. I gotta ask again. Secret menu. Just be like, bird's nest something. Looks so pretty, right? Oh, I don't even want to eat it. So this is on the secret menu. Black sugar bird's nest. So anyone can order this if they know the secret menu? Oh, okay. So it's like the in and out you know, animal fries and all that stuff. So you guys definitely try it. It's good. Now dinner time at Annalena. My friend Trish said this spot is popping, so we're having dinner together. Yay! All right, these are mussels. Trish said it's really good. This bread on top, and then there's mussels. It smells so bomb. Mussels off the shelf. Mussels off the shelf, so that's why right here, right here. You see that? That's a mussel, right? Good morning guys, today is sneaker con. I just got up, it's around 11 a.m. I'm headed to the Vancouver Convention Center, which is a block away. So that's good, right? That's why we always stay near the convention center. So it's super easy and, you know, don't need to get up early. That's my main concern. So it's across the street, I'm excited. So I'll see you guys then. All right, so I'm approaching the Vancouver Convention Center told you it was like a five minute walk beautiful day we need to get lunch at cactus club cafe again it was bomb i love this view the mountains is like a painting nice landscape it's so cold so glad i wore a lot of clothes i look like a little gorilla or teddy bear but it's all good stay warm and i don't want to get sick you know what i'm saying Right here, yep. My Union Ones and my jewel sweatpants from Supreme. All right, let's go. Huge lineup. Uh, crazy lineup, really good turnout. So, we shall see. All right, I'm gonna do a quick walkthrough for the front, hey. Let's see, whoa, there's a lot of people all the way down there too, you see? Oh, my bad, I'm trying to do two phones at once and it's kind of hard. It's pretty crazy. Starting soon at 12 p.m. It's around 11.30 right now. It's really crazy. Okay. All right. gotta stick this in somewhere oh my god I'm so excited for this you don't understand whoa 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 man those grill open Lego hi I reservation for Wendy Bubble Queen. <laughs> I hope it's good. Let's see. It smells kind of good. Bubble Waffles. It smells kind of good. Hi. Alright, got the Ferrara Rocher. It's 
slush for Ron and I got the mango flavor mochi slush. And then a matcha red bean bubble waffles. Can't wait to try. Yo, this is matcha red bean. Look, I'm gonna open one. Side. Red bean. Oh. Cute. This is the mango slush with bubbles. Check out the logo though. Where's the logo? It's white. Oh, shit. Bubble Queen. This is the Ferrera Rocher. Look, there's a Ferrera Rocher. The slush. Looks pretty good. We'll see how it tastes. Yeah, taste it. Good morning everyone. My last day in Vancouver. Nice day. I'm gonna do some activities with my friend today. My friend Trisha. And then have an early dinner and then head to the airport. My flight's at 10 p.m. And I get back on Monday at like 6 a.m. if there's no delays. I just woke up, so stuff your nose. Can't wait. All right, so I'm in Chinatown now. I forgot there's like Chinese New Year parades and stuff today because it's still Chinese New Year for two weeks. And you know, Vancouver is huge for Chinese community. Headed to Nam Pen for lunch. I'm trying to find a spot. It's like kind of dead around here, but crazy people like um, on the other street. I'll go, I'll try to go by. Here we are, Nam Pen. My friend Trisha said. This spot has like amazing food and chicken wings. So we're here. Gonna try this place out. I'm so excited. So let's see. Hopefully no long way. Oh, there's nobody, so we're good. Look how cute. I'm gonna ask for a table. Let's see. Oh, there's nobody, so we're good. All right. Let's check out the menu. Wow, it's a huge menu. I'm excited. Oh my god, food, food, food. Food is the best. I think it's gonna be packed later when people come back from the Chinese New Year thing. It's not even 12, it's 11.30 right now, so I think when 12 p.m. hits, it's gonna be crazy. Yo, so this is butter beef, it's raw, and there's a lot of cilantro, so I'm not eating this. a large order this is bomb Trish said this is what we came for so I'm excited to see and try this it smells really good beef stew it smells so good check out the fall mm, hope it's good everything's been so good so far so I'm pretty sure it is yo I'm just finished eating 12 30 now is packed crazy Everyone waiting. Thank goodness I came early, before 12. Quick dessert at Beta 5. Trish said the chocolates are bomb here. We shall see. <laughs> oh my god, it smells so good. Look at this. Oh, so pretty. Look at this Valentine's Day box. Wow. Really nice marbling. So pretty. It smells so good. And there's a factory in the back. You can buy the chocolate here too. Oh, and the box is Valentine's Day. Salted caramel cream puff. Oh my god, so cute. And what's this? What? No! Oh my god, okay. This is the lychee rose cream puff. So cute! Salted caramel, lychee rose. Which one? Got the lychee rose cream puff. So pretty! I got out of um, Beta 5 and it's snowing like crazy. I hope my flight's not delayed tonight. I'll be so mad. Crazy. Can't really see here, but in the naked eye, oh my god. Arrival to Lynn Canyon Park. It's snowing, but it looks really pretty actually. 
hopefully I can get some good footage. Get the suspension bridge and also the big Turn left um, on Park Road. The big waterfalls, I think it's called. Oh, there's still a lot of people parked. So I'm not the In only crazy feet, one. You'll arrive at Lynn Canyon Suspension Bridge. Your girl is at Lynn Canyon Park and of course not dressed for the weather. Everyone's in like hiking and snow gear and I'm in like full fur and no hat. It's no I didn't know it was snowing actually, so that's why. See in back of me? It's snowing like crazy. But you know, it's my last day here so I have to go um check it out. But um it is what it is. It isn't that bad. So yeah. I'll show you what shoes I'm wearing. You're gonna be like, oh shoot. But I really didn't look at the weather. Didn't expect this. But it's cool. I could just wash it, so I'm not worried about it. So I'm wearing my Adidas Bape Football Ultra Boost on a snowy weather. It's okay. I'll just clean them. It's just shoes, anyways. But I'm just afraid that it's gonna get wet. Problem with this is that sometimes it doesn't recognize like the height so there's like it takes a little time look how nice it is all right let's go to the suspension bridge first see we're not the only crazy ones going <laughs> there's kids going too i just wished i wore better shoes suspension bridge. It's not as big as the Capilano, but you know, this one is free. And shout to Shafiq for telling me to come here. It looks pretty neat. <laughs> I met a little super passionate golden retriever. So cute. I'm gonna go down the Lynn Cannon suspension bridge. Oh, there's someone up there so, so I'll wait a little bit. There's a dog. Yeah, I think they're trying to take a selfie. So I'll wait till they go. What's happening? Oh, he's taking a picture. I'll wait a little bit. All right, I don't want to wait no more. I'm going to just go. Alright, why I'm where we were next. Twin Falls. Twin Falls? Alright, let's go. It was like really slippery. But yo, it was beautiful. I'm glad I did it. And kinda glad it's snowing to be honest, because when are you gonna get it to snow? And I'm leaving tonight. So hopefully there's no delay, but I think it was like pretty damn nice. So hopefully my photos came out right. Fix the camera lens. This face tracking is not like 100, so got to work on this. There's a lot of people actually, so I'm not the only crazy one, okay? All right, when I get to Twin Falls, I'll show you guys. All right, so this place needs more signs. Not enough, I hope I don't get lost. Should be okay. I'm guessing it's this way, I'm listening for water. Okay, this way? My ass better not get lost. All right, let me put this away before I slip. I'll be back. All right, hopefully I'm headed to the right way for the Twin Falls. It's beautiful. All right, getting close. On the way, I had to like ask a few people. Snowing heavy here. 
Paris. Crazy. Balcony. I don't think you can see much. All right, I think I'm pretty much done. Gonna head back to the suspension bridge and then probably check out Richmond or something. Oh, it's snowing heavy here. Lego, pretty good. Even though I'm not dressed for it, but oh, it was nice. It was nice. I think I'm gonna head back to the suspension bridge and then um, call it a day. All right, this is a warning. Do not jump off the cliff. There's like fatalities. Crazy. I wouldn't do it anyway. Extreme danger. What is this? The Pacific Salmon Life Cycle. I love salmon. Back at Aberdeen Mall. You know where Spirit Tea was? Yep. I'm gonna check out the mall real quick before I grab a bite and head to the airport. I might grab a tea before I go to. Very Hong Kong in here. It's really nice. I got pee again. Super Hong Kong in here. I feel like I'm in freaking Hong Kong. Oh, they got Izu here too? Izu is like a Hong Kong, I think, IT brand. Wow. I guess this is a Chinese New Year thing. Look how pretty this the flower is. Chinese New Year celebration. Wonder if any Hong Kong celebrities are here. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go browse around. All right, a quick dinner before I head to the airport. Kumar, this is a Filipino joint. Um, a new friend of mine called Steven introduced this spot to me. He lives in Vancouver and he's Filipino. So it looks pretty good. I looked at the menu and then it looks really good. It's really early now, so there's not much people. It's like 6 p.m. All right, I'm gonna try this place out. Yes! Check out the menu. It's a very local joint, which I like. My friend said check out Sisig and Pala Palabak. So I'll see. But I want chicken adobo. Yes, my favorite. Lumpia, Shanghai. Oh my god. Let's see if it's good. Mmm, really good. Can't wait for the other food. Oh my god, I'm so excited for this. Pork sisig. Smells bomb. Sizzling. And then this. Garlic rice. I know my breath might stink on the flight, but I'm good. We're in an Asian flight. We're good. Don't let this little simple skewer fool you. It's really good. Barbecue pork skewer. I just got one because I got a lot of food. Oh, chicken adobo. The food came real quick. I'm gonna mix it with my rice. I love it. Look what he's doing. What, what are you doing? What is this? Raw egg. Raw egg. Cooking it. Time to go! International USA departures. This way. I need the elevator. Vancouver Airport. Pretty dope. Legit. The food looks good too. I guess it is Vancouver, right? I go check into my Cafe Pacific flight. Get a good night's sleep. Hopefully everything goes well. And I'll be back to New York. Time to go. And also thank you to Herschel for this Murakami duffel. Thank you, Michael Africa. Thank you so much. So cute. So excited to use it. I wanted it at ComplexCon, but it was a crazy line and then here we go big surprise for me perfect because i had a lot of gifts to me like chocolates and stuff all right time to go check in and get a good night's sleep really cute bag right i didn't bring that much stuff it looks like a big luggage but because it's winter gear so that's why it's big all right I have one hour to kill so i'm up in the lounge Totally reminds me of Hong Kong. The US lounges aren't that nice. This is the Sky Team lounge. 
Snow stopped. That's it. I think there's like food. I'll check it out. Noodle bar. Still open, but I'm full. Got some sandwiches. What's this? Noodles. Meatballs. Just some soup. Your girl's plane is here. Gonna pry board in like 10 to 20 minutes. So. I'm gonna knock out, be so tired. It's like 9.25 right now. It's supposed to be boarding now, but of course it's delayed. My plane is here though. It's still snowing. Look, my plane is here. I think the flight attendants and the pilot just arrived. Crazy snow. Of course the day I leave. Just landed. Gotta go through customs now. So, the Cathay Pacific flight. You don't go through customs because... I'm wearing these still. Because it's a Hong Kong flight to Vancouver and then Vancouver to New York. That's why. So now I gotta go through customs. Yeah, girl is back to NYC after a long process of um, waiting for the luggage. It took forever, the luggage. I was going through customs and everything was super quick. It's that global entry, but that waiting for the luggage was nuts. It wasn't even that many flights. But um, I'm safe and sound back home. I'm super happy to be back. Um, it's around, I think, 7.30 a.m. So I'm gonna take a rest and then I head to the office, you know, gotta hustle. So I'll see you guys later.